Good morning, everybody. Pastor Sarah here. September the 14th. It is a Monday. I'm the minister of First Christian Church in San Bernardino, California. Good to be with all of you. So we've had a smoky time here, a little bit of uh, fire here, um, and our air quality isn't the best. Um, up in Oregon, I was reading from a message from a regional minister in that area from our denomination in which she said that breathing inside was difficult uh, as well as outside because of the smoke from the fires. And I, it brought forth a memory for me. So three years ago when, when we moved to California, uh, California was in the midst of a terrible drought. It was just awful. There was uh, watering restrictions and you, they asked us to conserve water and so on. And in the midst of this, the San Manuel Band of Native Peoples um, had a, a powwow. And it was a, basically a national gathering of tribal people, indigenous peoples, and they would come forth and they would show their stuff by dancing, uh, their tribal arts. It, it's really a really cool event. It's open to the public. And there they danced. And so in the middle of dancing, out on the field, the rain poured. And afterwards, I'll never forget, one of the spokespersons of the event said uh, that they danced and it rained and how thankful they were. And I thought that was so cool. Normally, I don't think of asking God for rain because in many ways, I think of the things of the earth have been set in place and they will happen or they won't happen. And of course, in global warming, we human beings, we've just changed everything. But nonetheless, uh, I'm going to pray for rain, particularly for particularly for the state of Oregon, where they cannot breathe, to clear the air of smoke, to bring forth relief from wildfires. So if you will indulge me, I'm going to read just a verse from the prophet Joel. Be glad, people of Zion. Rejoice in the Lord, for he has given you the autumn rains because he is faithful. He sends you abundant showers, both autumn and spring rains as before. A word of the Lord, a prayer to God. Whatever your faith background is, I encourage you to pray for rain, especially for Washington and Oregon, Northern California, all up and down this West Coast. And while we're at it, I know that on the East Coast that storms are threatening um, the, the Gulf again. And it, it clearly, you're going to have more rain than you know what to do with, more water than you know what to do with. You are also in my heart and in my prayers. So let us support and love one another. My friends, I hope you are healthy and well, that you are safe from all sorts of issues with weather. And I pray for your well-being and your safety. May God bless you until we meet again. Thanks for being with me. Bye-bye.